the Falcon 9 rocket making that decision autonomously. Now we are T minus 30 seconds from liftoff of our Starlink payload tonight. So let's listen in and watch liftoff. throttle down our engines in preparation for max Q, and that is the maximum aerodynamic pressure, which is the largest structural load that the vehicle will see. That's coming up here in a few seconds. Max Q. And there's that call out that we have just passed through max Q. In about a minute, we will have three events happening back to back. The first of which will be main engine cutoff, or MECO. This is where all nine M1D engines shut off to slow the vehicle down in preparation for the second event, which is stage separation. Stage separation is where the first stage separates from the second stage, with the first stage, first stage starting to make its way back to Earth for landing, and stage two continuing on its journey, with the third event called SES-1, or second engine start one. And that's where the MVAC engine lights up on the second stage and propels the second stage along with the Starlink satellites to its drop-off orbit. Stage separation confirmed. if those fairing halves can be recovered by our recovery ships Miss Tree and Miss Chief today. Again, we won't have that live. That will happen. Stage one FTS has saved. Stage one entry burn has started. And then you hear that call out as well as a visual confirmation that those engines have reignited. The vehicle continues to follow normal trajectory. Stage 1 entry burn shut down. T plus eight and a half minutes. About eight minutes and 24 seconds. Looks like we lost that live view of the first stage coming down, but that is expected. Hopefully we can get that live view back. Right now stage you're one seeing... Is Right now, what you're seeing on your left screen is the drone ship just read the instructions. Followed very closely after the landing burn and landing of the first stage will be Seco 1, that is second engine cutoff, around T plus 8 minutes and 58 seconds.
stage one landing burn has started. Okay. Landing legs have deployed. Stage two FTS has saved. Second stage engine cut off. What an amazing view of that first stage coming down. And again, the first unit with the sun visor is actually on this payload right here that you see in front of you. And there is that confirmation. We got a live view as it was deploying from the vehicle. The Starlink satellites are making their way, separating from second stage right in front of you right now. Shortly, they will deploy their solar array, and over the next few days and weeks, they will distance themselves from each other and use their onboard ion thrusters to make their way to their operational orbit. And also, just to note, tomorrow is June 4th. That was actually the anniversary of our first Falcon flight. 10 year anniversary of our first flight. So very exciting time. First Falcon 9 flight. So very, very exciting times. And that brings our webcast to a close. Follow our website and social media platforms for updates on our next missions and milestones. Please stay safe, stay healthy, and we'll see you at the next launch.